I can just tell you that I've always known what I've thought on this issue, that every single woman in this country should be able to make her own decisions about her own body. Every single session in the United States Congress, I voted to repeal the Hyde Amendment. I co-sponsored legislation to do the same. And as president, not only will I ensure that we nominate justices who believe that the 1973 decision, Roe versus Wade, is the law of the land, we will complement that by statute with our partners in Congress to make sure that no state can deny any woman the ability to have access to the health care that she needs. We'll also roll back the gag rule and we'll make sure that our Department of Justice vigorously defends women in every single courtroom. I think it's time that more men join the leadership that women have provided on this issue. And I've consistently been there and I want to make sure that as president, we do everything in our power to make sure that we stand with women in every single case. Is there any room in the Democratic Party now for those who oppose abortion? Look, I think that's a, a question that the candidates, including Vice President Biden, are going to have to answer for themselves. Um, I can just tell you that in the midst of a maternal mortality crisis in this country, three times as deadly for women of color, um, access to care is critically important. In my home state of Texas, we saw more than a quarter of our family planning clinics close. It means not only that fewer women are able to access a safe, legal abortion, but the cervical cancer screenings, the family planning help, uh, the ability to see a provider of any kind. This is a life and death matter. So it is very hard for me to believe that we could ever produce a nominee who would not believe in a woman's right to choose and the ability to stand and, and, and the, the mandate for us to stand with women in each and every instance. That's what I believe. That's part of why I'm, I'm running. And, and I think that's a core value, not just of the Democratic Party, but of the United States of America.